I was good at math and I knew I wanted to do something with math. Most people don't hear about you know, actual science until they're somewhere in college. My dad told me about it when I was like the sixth grade. So I'm like, oh, I'm telling everyone in the seventh grade I want to be an actuary, so it's kind of weird. When I was in high school, you know, um, the guidance counselor was, was very good and she just recommended LVC's had a good actuarial program. So I was looking to get far away from Pennsylvania, but I came to LVC and just loved the campus. The professors were great. Something I also really thought was great was the liberal arts nature of the college. And I didn't really think about it so much at the time, but now as I look through, I'm working as an actuary, I work with a lot of actuaries, but I work with a lot of non-actuaries. So having the well-rounded skill set you know, comes from having these other classes that I, I took outside of the math department. Education at LBC has been a great preparation for life after college. The things that I really took away, someone with excellent education. When I went and worked at Hancock, just, you know, working with people who went to Harvard and all these other great schools, I'm able to, like, compete with them and, and everything. So, just excellent education. Giving back to me is recognizing that you might be more fortunate than others. So, it's always best to help out where you can and be involved and, and you know, be a part of your community. The LVEV Mentor Program, uh, really, really great thing they, they had going on here. You're we bringing in uh, kids who are somewhat at risk, you know, middle school students, and they would come and just get mentorship from some, you know, um, college students. I think one of the great things was the students made it through the program. I know there would be some scholarship, you know, money that would be set aside for them. So my involvement with LVC right now, my main involvement right now is part of the Leadership Council. And then one thing that's more recent, even just today, you know, finally get, being able to come on campus and uh, interview students for, you know, internships and, and full-time work, you know, for Voya Financial. I'm really just honored to, to receive it. I'm not really sure exactly what I did to deserve it, you know, but I, I hope I can live up to, to what this represents and, and, you know, be a good steward of uh, the responsibility that, that comes with this.